Hello friends. Today, I will show you how to make a home automation project using IR remote, push buttons, and ESP Rainmaker. You can easily control all the devices using ESP Rainmaker while you are connecting to the internet. Here the blue LED indicates that the project is connected to the Wi-Fi. If I turned off the Wi-Fi, then the blue LED will also turned off, which indicates that no internet connection is available. But you can still control your lights using push buttons. I have also added the remote control feature in the project to turn on and off the relays by using any IR remote. The status of the relays are stored in the EEPROM memory. So if the module is reset due to power failure, the latest status of the relays will reload again when the power comes again. Lastly, you can monitor the real-time status update of your lights in the Rainmaker app. If you want to add the voice control in your project, then you can add the Google Assistant and Amazon Alexa in the Rainmaker app from the settings. Next, here are the project code files and wiring diagram. You can download it from the description of the video. Next, to make this project, you need ESP32 development module, 4 channel relay module, 38 kHz IR receiver, IR remote. You can use any remote you have. 4 push buttons with 1K resistors. You will have to connect these components as per wiring diagram. Here I have added the resistors to each push button to remove any noise due to the loose connections. I have powered the whole project by connecting 5 volts to the V-in pin of the ESP32 module. Next, to connect the AC appliances to relays, you just follow this diagram. The connections are very simple. I have already connected all the components on breadboard as per wiring diagram. Next, let's move to the coding part of the project. First, just copy the highlighted URL. This URL will be used to install the ESP32 board. So paste the URL here in the additional board manager. Now open the board manager to install the ESP32 board. Search for ESP32. Install the version 2.0.3. After installing the ESP32 board, go to Tools. Here, select the ESP32 Arduino and then select ESP32 development module. Next, click on partition scheme, and then select the Rainmaker. Now the ESP32 module setup is completed. Next, you need to install the Easy Button library and IR Remote library. You can install the both libraries from the library manager. Here search for Easy Button. I am using the easy button library to control the push buttons effectively. Next, you have to install the IR remote library. This library will be used to pass the IR remote data. The last thing you will have to change is the IR hex code. So, scroll down to the end of the code. Here, enter your IR remote hex codes for each button. To get the hex codes, just open the ircodes.ino file. Upload it to your microcontroller. Then open serial monitor. Now you can use the IR remote to get the hex codes for each button. After getting the hex codes, you just enter them in the main sketch one by one. Now the code is ready. Hit upload button to upload the code to ESP32 development board. After uploading the code, open serial monitor. Now press and hold the boot button for more than 3 seconds. Then release the button. Now look at the serial monitor, you will see the QR code URL. Just copy this URL and paste it in some web browser like Google Chrome. The QR code is generated. We will use this QR code to save the Wi-Fi credentials in the project. So open the ESP Rainmaker app from your phone. Then turn on Bluetooth of the phone. Now, tap on the Add Device button.
Then, scan the QR code. Then, tap on Pair. On the next page select your Wi-Fi SSID, and enter your Wi-Fi password. Next, it will start configuring the Rainmaker app with the project. Now, tap on Done. Here, you can see the app is ready. Now you can control your home appliances, using Rainmaker app. That's all. This is for today. If you have any question, then comment below. See you in the next video. Bye.